guys, Rob here with Deluxe Gaming, and welcome back to my Beyond Soul series, episode 11. Wow, I can't believe we're already at 11. That's crazy, and I'm not even doing these that often. Yeah, it's actually been a few days since our last episode. I've been super busy this week, so I apologize for that. But we are back, and, of course, there is another update because the developers, you know, they're persistent, and it's really, really good. All right, so we have update 8.05. So we'll go through this really quickly, some of the really important things to note here. Ships in your fleet increase your inventory capacity. I've been saying that for a long time, so actually... I'm really pleased to see that distress calls will now sometimes come from your own freighters <laughs> And if you defend them, you will get a temporary bonus to your tariff income. I think that's super cool I yeah I, I, Increased income is okay. Uh, it'd be cool if I don't know I don't know it seems like something more needs to happen there if you defend your own territory like it seems still like there's a little too much like there's a lot of reward for defending your the other factions in in the in the universe you know like you get diplomatic bonus plus you get uh income as well so it uh, seems like there should be a little bit more there i don't know maybe not i don't know but uh rebalance the penalties for negative population hangar space uh power uh our last rebalance led to some exploits i don't know what those exploits are but apparently it was there um do, 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 something else here the oh increase max camera zoom by 15 percent. so i don't know if that means that we can zoom in by another 15% or, or we can zoom out. Hopefully it's zoom out because zooming out, I, I was always hoping that we could kind of see more of the landscape as we do our fighting and stuff. And I don't know if that's a performance reason, like why they wouldn't allow that. I don't know, I have no idea. But either way, I'm pleased to see that that is, uh, they're, they're working on that and improving that. Fix a bug, a bug where you permanently lose a salvage drone. That's happened to me. <laughs> I think it happened to me in one of the recordings. Of course it happened to me in one of the recordings, because I only really play this on YouTube. And other bugs, bug fixes, and UI improvements. So anyway, that's pretty cool. And there's some other odds and ends, but, uh, and I'm sure we're going to see, hopefully, hopefully the save game works. <gasps> Cross your fingers, here we go. So far, it's been great, actually. The, the save game, I haven't had any problems up to this point. Whereas, you know, some of the alpha games that we play, you know, it's it's touch and go. Ah, oh, what do we got here? Oh, we got, that's right, that's right. We bought the Guardian. We were going to buy the other, I, I think the Exeter version of the uh, new ship. Or the uh, <laughs> the Tech 3 ship. I, I forget, I forget. Honestly, it's been a few days. Okay, so let's take a look at the landscape. Right, Crichton. They're still, they're still neutral with us there. Peace, as long as we keep doing missions for them. And actually, let's open up with a mission because um, <laughs> I need to kind of get wormed up here. Um, yeah, so as long as we keep doing missions for them, we should be okay. And Mars, right, we kind of stole this area right out from under them. That is right. And actually, we might just steal these two right away too. Why not? Uh, our inventory. Uh, inv what? Hold on, hangar. Hold on. I, I guess I can't see that stuff. Right. Okay. So I can. Yeah. Oh, I guess we had a kind of a full hull <laughs> before we uh, before we left. All right. So let's let's show that we still know how to play this game. Right. That's right. I remember that. Perfect. Okay. Whoop. Okay. 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 Uh, yeah. So there's still a lot of bonuses for attacking or doing these missions for other people. Now, I don't know, maybe maybe, maybe it is a really nice increment in the tariff money, and maybe it lasts for a long time too. So maybe it is worthwhile, I don't know. And you know, money seems to be that one thing that you always seem to be out of, so that's good. I'm just collecting stuff, I'm letting my guys do all the fighting. Like, go get him guys, I'm just gonna get all the stuff. <laughs> Hope you don't mind. Um, but you know, like, fighting is a lot of work and stuff. <laughs> They're like, you son of a... Yeah, no, that's okay. But, uh, yeah, oh, yeah, I still like, uh, so, it, I don't know if we're zoomed out more. Hold on, let's see if we can, hold on, zooming out more. Ah, there we go, okay, I see. So, it's plus and minus, so, hold on. <laughs> uh, uh-oh. Oh, there we go. Oh, we can zoom right in, okay, cool. And it looks like we can zoom out just a little bit more. That's, that's kind of nice. I like that. Um, but I'd still like to be able to zoom out even more than that, because when, when you're, like, at a city... At one of the one of the cities, like some of these cities are huge. Kyler agreed to a peace treaty with Santosh, so those guys uh, just have to remember everything here. Yeah. Okay. So uh, hold on. <laughs> uh, brain fart. Okay. Uh, where the heck is Ky Oh, there they are, Kyler and Santosh. Okay, good. And uh, Hal Halakai, these guys were fighting a lot. 
with uh, Crystal City, who I thought were gonna declare war on me. They still may declare war on me. Yeah, because they're they're super hostile. Okay, so let's go get this comet really quickly. Actually, do we even have any room in our ship now? Probably not. Ah, we got a little bit of room. You know, we don't. Yeah, might as well go back with a full hold. Yeah. So this used to be. I think we were at the 120 mark, so now we're at 180 because we, we're traveling with three ships. So I'm assuming each ship is like 20. Oh, guess that comet's got eh? Oh no, there it is. Perfect. Yeah, so each ship that you have in your fleet adds uh, another 20 inventory space. So that's pretty cool. I really like that. So eventually when you get these big fleets, of course, you, you just, you're just able to be out longer. And I, I think that's really important. Okay, so let's go. Uh, actually, we'll go drop off our stuff. Actually, no, no, we're not going to do that. I changed my mind a lot here. We are going to go place some more... I'm not going to place one here, uh, but we're going to go place some more radar stations just along the border. And apparently the guys at uh, Praxia Games are working on some new outposts and stuff and maybe some ways to defend those outposts so i'm really excited to see what they're going to come up with and uh yeah i'm hoping maybe the next patch or something i don't know who knows yeah so i think what we're going to do is we're going to place some radar stations all the way down here i'm just going to be super super aggressive because crydon i think we can keep at bay because well <laughs> we have them wrapped around our finger honestly as long as we keep doing missions for them yeah they're back up to we could probably convince them to become friends with us again eventually oh Pirate station. Oh, is this one that we destroyed a long time ago? Oh, crazy. I didn't realize it would still be here. Oh, that's nuts. Okay, so first off, let's build our little radar station. So uh, if that's the case, we should uh, we should actually go get, um, go, go empty out our hold and then come back here and get the stuff. So let's just remember to come back here. Because, <laughs> I don't know, that's 112, 112 minerals is worth, I think that was one that we said we were going to come back for and we never did. So it sticks around for a while. That's kind of cool. I don't know, but it's, you'd think that somebody would have come and maybe claimed that. <laughs> well, maybe not. I don't know. They're like, maybe they don't want to mess with us. I don't know. We're becoming a force to be reckoned with. I don't even know if we have enough minerals for all this. I'm just assuming that we do. Um, yeah, and it looks like we're okay. So I'm just, I'm just, you know, I'm going. Oh, maybe we should. Uh, Maybe we should start to take over some of this area around New Brazil, too. Oh, that's another thing that the developer Praxia says they're working on, is making... I think there was a tweet today, I think they said something about making it so that uh, um, you don't have to accept a, a surrender from the, from the enemy, so you can just conquer them. And that would be actually really nice, because once you get to a certain point, you know, once you do get to that tipping point in the game, and, and there needs to be that tipping point in the game, I think, you know... Of course you want a challenge, right? So we want a challenge up to a certain point, and I think the mid-game is, is, you know, that's where you want most of your challenges. But you do kind of almost want eventually to get to a point where you just walk over everybody, and when you get to that point, you don't want it to take forever. I think that's, I think that's the key, right? So, you know, I mean, that's, it's like, it's like RPG games. So you spend all this time building up your characters, and unless you're doing some, uh, playing something like Oblivion that kind of matches your level. Everything kind of matches your level all the time, which kind of, I don't know, kind of bugs me. I, I, but in most RPGs, you know, you're building up your levels as, so that you can comp accomplish bigger and bigger, bigger and better things. But eventually it gets to a tipping point where everything starts to become kind of easy. And that's okay, because that's what you were fighting for the whole time. But at that point in the game, it, there should be a way to just finish the game, right? And, uh, you know, I, I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that because I like I like RPGs that are like that, where you you do you do get that build up and you get up to that really high level where you're just able to walk over all over your enemies, except for maybe the big bad boss, right? You know, the big bad boss maybe a little bit more of a challenge. All right, let's take care of these guys. Oh, we're yeah, okay, we're helping some some of our friendlies here at Crydon, I think. Oh, it's Crydon. Isn't that their name? <laughs> uh, yes, Crydon. Yeah, so these are Crydon bad guys. Or cried on good guys. Actually, we're defending. Oh, somebody's raiding one of our bases. So we'll go have to. We'll have to go deal with that right away too. All right. <laughs> uh, collect, collect, collect. Uh, are we full? No, because we used up some of those minerals. That's fantastic. Perfect. <laughs> I'm so greedy. I want it all. I want everything. And actually, our base is full of minerals. And uh, yeah, we actually can't hold anything more. So we'll just finish this finish this off. We're gonna go we're gonna go on a selling spree, and maybe we should do some traveling. And, and if we were friends enough with New Brazil, that would be the the people I would choose to go. Uh, should we should we build a thing here? Yeah, let's let's do that before we go. Wow, there's a lot. Oh, they're pirate raid. What are they raiding? Oh, they're raiding one of our. Yeah, but I don't know. 
I don't know, not a huge deal. I'm more interested in putting a repair station here and stopping any more growth from our enemies. We're just gonna, I'm just gonna be super, super aggressive from now on. Whoops, I didn't mean to slow down my ship. We're gonna be super aggressive and hopefully, you know, at some point, somebody's gonna be like, uh, we need to kill this deluxe guy because he's, he's, he's a serious problem. And all right, let's go. Let's head back. We've done a lot enough damage. Look at this. Oh, yeah Brazil hates us minus 60 I wonder how far we can like how badly can we make them hate us? Like I want them to hate us We even say their name and they all they all swear and spit <laughs> Somebody can, the, like deluxe becomes a swear in their land. That's what I want <gasps> Radar station was raided. Oh, they took 2,000 credits big deal. How much are we making right now? 3,874 per minute um, and it's gonna be way more once we put some population in too. So we'll do that when we get back here put in this population We have tons of power. Awesome. That's amazing. Actually. We have quite a bit of money just lying around too <laughs> you, We just placed all those radar stations as well. So yeah uh, I w And we need to put some defenses in pretty soon, but whatever Whatever. I'm not a, I don't fear anybody right now uh, so Right now. I would say the game is pretty easy. Oh no repairs. Oh wow crazy. Um, maybe I'm just super good at it, but I doubt that. <laughs> I hi whoops, I highly doubt that. Let's upgrade our. Oh, that's commercial. Uh, I I'm regretting putting the commercial in there because I don't know. It seems like a waste of space. All right, so that brings our population up to five. Can we do another one? Yeah, let's get a rate up. Ah, that was totally worth the money. There, we got lots of population, so we can just keep putting radar stations down like crazy. Let's go to the. Oh, another pirate raid. Okay, so before we go do that, let's. Uh Hold on, let's put this at 25. Put everything over that we can, and then just, it's easier to see if it's all over in one spot, right? Oh, there we go. Yes, yeah, so uh, let's sell some th thorium, and we'll sell some titanium, and we'll sell some uranium, and yeah, we'll just bring everything back down to that kind of reasonable level. If it's under 50, then we're not gonna sell anything. There, we got lots of room on us, and perfect. And we should have a little bit of money while we're here, I wonder, should we upgrade our turrets or should we... So if we upgrade it, it requires more population, requires more maintenance. But it doesn't really tell us what it does. But I'm going to do it anyway, because that just seems like the right thing to do. We're going to upgrade this one too as well. And we're going to place a new one down. Because I am starting to get a little bit, a little bit nervous because... Oh, I wonder, can I put this... Oh, I can put a shield thingy like right there. <gasps> shield generator. Yeah! Yeah, I bet that use a lot, uses a lot of power. Oh, power required three, okay. But yeah, they're right beside the turrets and I could maybe do another one. No, I can't do another one here. That would have been a great place to put another one over here too. That protects the turrets, but that, oh, that's awesome. All right, so what about uh, still, oh, we need to upgrade the Exeter thing. Oh, I forgot about that. <laughs> yes, uh, oh, radar station was raided. Oh, they only took a thousand, big deal. Seriously, you guys, like, come on. Um, and we're making 5,470 per minute. Oh, okay, trade treaties. Uh, Kyler, Crystal City, tr uh, trade treaty, okay. Declaration of War, uh, Crystal City and Halakai. Again, Crystal City and Valdor. Ooh, now's a good time to attack Crystal City. Maybe we should go do that. All right, but before we do that, let's see, uh, can we, we can't add any more to our fleet. So maybe, maybe I know what we need to do. Yes, uh, we need to improve our hangar space. Do we have enough? No, we don't have enough titanium to do that. So let's add another hangar. Because I'm really liking the idea of massive fleets. And uh, these hangars are the way to do that. So let's... Can I upgrade this one to level 2 right away? No. Okay, do, do I have enough money to buy another ship? Or at least... <laughs> uh, maybe upgrade. I know I want I want that other Exeter ship too, but uh, you know maybe we should upgrade not the Guardian, the Chimera. Upgrade. Whoops! I just bought a level three Chimera. Whoops! I meant to upgrade. That's okay. Uh, do we have enough room to? Ah, oh, we don't. Okay, we can take a level two. Oh man, I made a mistake there. Uh, we need to upgrade this this hangar. Uh, we need titanium. How much titanium do we need? We need uh, six more. Uh, let's do that right now <laughs> I'm a little clueless. I'm a little clueless. I'm not gonna lie to you. All right So we just need to buy one two three four five six perfect and then we can upgrade this to level What oh not enough credits. Ah, how much credits? Uh, 296 really really okay, so we can sell anything but titanium or uranium a little bit of a balancing act to make this work sometimes. So we'll just, oh, perfect. We'll just sell a little bit of that. Perfect. And we'll upgrade. 
And then we can take our third Chimera. I, I, we're really focusing on the Chimera. I didn't really mean to buy it. I meant to upgrade it, but whatever. All right, now we have another Chimera. All right, we are undocking. Look at this. All right, let's go attack uh, New Brazil. Or should we go after Crystal City? They're, they're totally at war. Let's look at our diplomatic relations with them. And actually, I just want to see. So they have uh, four active fleet. We are attacking Crystal City. We're totally attacking them. We're going to go after this uranium. Jumping. Awesome. Oh, sorry. I had to clap there. <laughs> Probably sounded funny through the microphone, but I was clapping because I was so excited. I get really excited about these kinds of things. Maybe we'll stop at the uh, stop at the comet. Stop at the local comet. Grab some comet stuff. <laughs> you know, you'd think there was... I hope they do add more minerals eventually. Um, I know that's complicated. It's probably super complicated, but... You know, you'd think I, maybe there should be ultra rare minerals that allows you to only build certain things and stuff. I guess the comet's gone. You know, I just think they could, there's just, just a whole world of stuff. And, you know, maybe you could find alien artifacts and stuff lying around and you can install it on your ships and stuff. That would be super cool. Um, super cool. Um, I might have the chance soon to speak with the developers of, uh, of Beyond Soul. Um, I just, I, I, I might have an opportunity to do that. So... I'm kind of thinking that uh, that might be a thing. <laughs> I don't want to get anybody's hopes up, but I might be able to get it. I might have a chance to talk to them pretty soon. Let's just head towards their core here, or their radar station. We're going to destroy these radar stations after we, of course, uh, declare war uh, on Crystal City. Declare war. Yes. Oh, right on. They're mad at us. Wow. Okay. So let's. There we go. And uh, might as well just fire some rounds while we're waiting for the fleet to come in, because we know they're coming. They are coming. Oh, what's going on here? Friendly city. Oh, right, because... Uh-oh, here they are. Oh, they're in Chimera 3s. Oh, wow. Okay, I'm going to use my shield thingy, and I'm going to do my best to try and take out one of the Chimeras. Oh, I should have upgraded some of our, my, like, my main weapons and stuff like my... I think I did upgrade our missile last time, if I remember correctly. Oh, yes, 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 awesome. All right, there we go. Next. Wow, they came in with, uh-oh. Uh-oh, did we lose our entire fleet? Um, oh my God. Okay, uh, we might be in trouble. Uh, I'm gonna keep this guy, oh, shields up. Oh, they came in with like, did you see those? Those were like massive capital ships. <gasps> awesome, got him. So, we lost our entire fleet. Fortunately, it only costs money to buy, to buy ships. So that's not a huge deal, but it is a big deal. It's a big deal in the sense that I lost my entire fleet. I, they had capital ships. How, how come I don't have capital ships? How do I get capital ships? Oh man, okay. Did not expect that, and maybe I shouldn't have attacked them. They're probably attacking us. Hold on. Um, uh-oh. Outpost under attack. Crystal City's under attack by Baldor. Okay, let's let's go get them. Um, it's probably a bad idea. Because <laughs> we have no fleet anymore. Um, pirates raided our station. Okay, lots, lots of stuff is happening here. Uh, okay. I thought we destroyed their radar, but maybe not. Okay, so here we go. Uh, oh, this is not good. Uh, time to go. They're firing big weapons, like big plasma weapons and stuff. Those are big ships. Okay, we need to go home. <laughs> uh, actually, we're gonna, no, no, we, we need to go straight home. Straight home. Uh-oh. See, how come they have capital ships? There must be ships that, okay. Yeah, we lost a little bit of hull there. Oh, that... So, we're winning the war! That's good, so we may actually force them to surrender, but we need to... We need to buy more ships. Man, that was brutal. It's brutal. What are those capital ships? So, I was... It was something I was actually wondering about the game, because during the uh, trailers for this game, of course, we saw capital ships. So, when do they come into play for us? Like, when do we get to... I Also, I want to fly a capital ship, or, you know, I want to have access... At least to a capital ship. Outpost under attack. Uh, probably, probably, yeah, probably by uh, the Crystal City. So we need to stop 
dock and roll. Or stop, dock, and buy more ships. Oh, declare of war. Oh no, New, New Brazil's mad at us. Well, of course New Brazil's mad at us. How could they not be mad at us? You know, I might have bitten off more than we could chew, but I don't know. I was kind of feeling like we needed to do that. <laughs> Repair! Uh, fleet, buy, we need to buy some uh, chimeras. Sure, done. And we do have uh, some backup ships here if necessary. No, nope, that's fine. We can totally just stock up with our ships from home here. Perfect. Done. Undock. <laughs> We're not taking any special ships this time. Uh, they, okay, New Brazil. I, I will come kick your butt, New Brazil. And we got pirates attacking our bases or our, our radar stations and stuff here. I don't care. You know what? That's fine. Um, can I actually? No. Uh, so Crystal City got some points because they attacked. They attacked one of our outposts. <laughs> yeah, we might have really been up more than we can chew, but we will demolish New Brazil. I'm not worried about New Brazil at all. Yeah. So they were under attack by Valdor. I hope we didn't attack the wrong guy. Maybe Valdor was the one. No, no, no. <gasps> New Brazil. You. you? Oh. Wow, okay, so New Brazil just got a whole lot of points. So we should go directly for the city. Station was raided. They got zero, but whatever. Uh, we should have should have emptied our hold. I always forget that. All right, so we are going to go, and we're going to attack New Brazil then. Um, outpost under attack. No, nope, we're going to go defend our outpost. Make sure that uh, our little guy gets back. I don't know if it matters, but there we go. Jump. And uh, this could be either New Brazil or Crystal. And uh, if it's Crystal, I don't know. They, they, they have some big ships, man. I mean, they, we were doing okay. Well, I was doing okay. The rest of our fleet got crushed. Oh yeah, this is this is the big ships. Oh boy. Oh no, New Brazil. No, no, no. This isn't the big ships. This is just New Brazil. Okay, no problem. I got you. I got you. You're not gonna. You're not gonna do so well here, buddy. There we go. Yes, missile in the bomb. Missile in the bomb. Oh, too far away. Yeah, I'm not too worried about New Brazil. Uh, we can take them. Looks like they did some damage to our uh, thingy, but this will this is good payback. Seriously, we're they're at 37 percent. Holy crap! How did that happen? Okay, they must be attacking something else. We need to go attack their base or something. Like we're losing the war. Uh, let's repair this thing. Yes, I think we have to wait here. I don't know. I have no idea. Another outpost under attack. Okay, so we need to go this direction. This could be Crystal City now. Okay, away we go. I hope this keeps repairing after we go. <laughs> I hit the button. I don't know if that means anything. All right, so we're, we're fully armed here. Nobody's damaged. All right, good, good, good. Actually, it's great. Once you've got... I think upgrading your ships is, is the hardest part. Once they're upgraded, like, they're actually not expensive to buy. Uh-oh. This looks dangerous. Oh, this is Crystal City stuff. Emperors. Uh-oh. Oh, big ships. Big ships. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Why? We have no shields at all. Wow, these things have awesome shields. You see that? Like, didn't even... Barely made a chink in the armor. We need... I need those plasma torpedoes. Uh-oh. They demand our surrender. Um... I refuse. I refuse to surrender. Sorry, I, I don't. I don't. I don't play that game. You know what? Uh, yeah, we just kicked your butt. I refuse. I refuse your surrender. All right. So it looks like we lost somebody. Um, that was awesome, though. Uh, I. They were easier to destroy than I expected. I expected a uh, little bit more of a challenge there. But I th they were all damaged too. That and, and that's the other thing. So a mining station. Oh man, they're raiding my mining stations. The pirates are just having a field day on us. Like they're like partying at all of our stations. They're like, oh, destroy this, destroy that, attack this, attack that, because he can't do anything because he's defending his butt against you know bigger bigger guys than us. Oh, inventory's full. All right, so let's. Uh, <laughs> um, you know what? Ah. Uh... Do we just let's let's go attack New Brazil? Let's force them to surrender. Except they're at fifty percent. Like, how badly damaged are we? Oh man, we're we're in rough shape. <laughs> but uh, shouldn't be that bad. Uh, I wonder. Can I? Oh, I should have. <laughs> can I just? Can I just say peace? Peace, truce, truce. We will not back down. Right. Okay. Of course. I just didn't like the way surrender sounded. Surrender. Of course, implies that we're, you know, 
I, I, it's too much pride here, I know. I know, I, sh I have way too much pride, and that's probably to my own detriment. Or we know it's to my own detriment. We're gonna destroy these population centers, because, uh, yeah, that's... That's the secret of their power. Oh! Oh, no. Looks like the missile worked okay. But the... Uh, yeah. I wish I could tell my guys what to attack. That's the next thing. I, I need to tell them to attack the population centers, because I think that's... Well, that's where they're getting all their power, right? Because they keep rebuilding because of these power centers. Uh, yes, we're going to accept... Oh! Oh, I just accepted... I surrendered! I didn't mean to do that. I thought it was New Brazil. I was too quick to hit the button. Aw, oh, man. <laughs> that blows. Okay, well, we'll try to get that money back from New Brazil. Yikes. Well, at least uh, Crystal City can't attack us for 10 minutes. Um, <laughs> okay, let's attack another one of these population centers. Oh, shields. Okay, let's attack the shields then. <laughs> okay, yeah, I totally bit off more than I could chew. And it looks like Crydon's kind of mad at us right now, too. Maybe because they were friends with Crystal City. I wonder if that's what it was. I bet you that's totally it. Pirate raids. Oh, man, we're, we're totally going broke here. <laughs> yep, we lost some ground. I made some bad decisions. I am a bad leader sometimes. Um, but I just wanted to see some, like, serious action. And, yeah, they do get... They do take it personally when you, when you keep attacking them, so... Ah, uh, see, now we're winning the war. We're at 94%. And I'm just going to keep attacking them until, yeah, until I feel like they are done. Um, and I wonder, they're probably going to offer me a surrender first. I can probably force a surrender. I can probably go to the diplomatic panel, but I'm not going to do that. I want to see how far I can take it. They we're at 100%. Uh, yeah, okay, so it's weird because... Usually at 100%, they've already decided they're going to declare truce. And as long as they don't have any population centers, then how are they going to rebuild? Like, this might be the end. This might be the end of New Brazil. Ha ha ha! New Bra Oh. Uh, I refuse your surrender. I'm going to keep attacking... Uh, looks like... Oh, now their control center. Let's do it. Let's do it. Attack their control center. It seems to be staggering a little bit right now. I don't know why. Maybe it's just all these explosions. Uh, stupid pirates. There must be another... I think there was another pirate base or something kicking around. I guess I guess we'll find out soon enough. So, uh, we are just demol... Like, our guys have demolished, like, so much. Uh, no, I refuse. I refuse your surrender. I'm I'm mad. I You actually attacked us back. And I know, we, we totally deserved it. I admit that we totally deserved it, but... Uh, yeah, not cool, guys. Not cool. <laughs> I, I'm i not going to be happy until you guys are, like, gone. I, like, I want you removed from the map because, yeah, because I just, I because what I say. You know, uh, so Crystal City had 99 points of ships in reserve. That's, that's terrifying. So, yeah, no, I refuse. <laughs> so it looks like because they're under 50 now, because I think they're totally under 50. Yeah, they're, like, nine. I think they were under 50. When we started this battle, and now they're done. I think they're done, done. Oh, they're down to six, so they still have something going on? What can else what else can we destroy? There must be something else. Ah, population center, there we go. <laughs> yes! You guys are done. So once they're under 50, apparently, we can just keep attacking until they're dead. Neat! Uh yes, no, no, we I refuse. Sorry. Um, well not really sorry. <laughs> I am a jerk. I am such a jerk. I just, I prayed on them. Right from the get-go, they're just like, why do these guys hate us so much? And yeah, every time they say our name, they, they spit. Deluxe. <laughs> uh, super funny. Okay, I think that's pretty much it. Oh, yes, we did it. Let's go home. Uh, after we sell some stuff at Valdor, because uh, <laughs> we have a lot of stuff on us, and uh, we need to get as much as we can. There we go, look! We destroyed, wow, we actually destroyed New Brazil. Fantastic, we did lose some ground here. Um, actually, no, 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 before you go any, uh, yeah, I'm gonna claim some of this first before we go start selling stuff. Wow, that was, that was pretty awesome. I'm pretty, oh, what's this? Uh, Kyler City and Crystal City have signed an alliance. Oh, Kyler. Oh, pirate. Bloody pirates. Oh. 
Okay, so they have become a problem. I remember when I was saying before, uh, remember what I was saying before that, oh, big deal, they, they're they raiding, big deal. But if they just keep doing it, it's actually kind of a pain. Um, being that we're kind of broke as it is. <laughs> so I want to claim all this before Crystal City claims it. I know they're going to declare war on us again, and I encourage that behavior because it gives us an excuse to attack them again. We're doing okay. I mean, um, I, that was the first time that we've been to war with somebody really big. And, of course, uh, we did okay, uh, considering I lost all my ships and, well, you know. <laughs> Whoops. I forgot what I was doing. Oh, not enough credits. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. All right, let's go. Uh, there must, there's a pirate station here. Exactly. That's exactly what's happening. I'm going to go sell everything I have at Valdor. After I collect these minerals, because I think I freed up some space in my hold. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. Valdor, I think they really like us right now. Uh, let's just see here. Yeah, attacked our enemy. Thir plus 33. So actually, we're in pretty good shape with them. <laughs> um, Uh-oh. Oh, we're being attacked by pirates? Probably pirates. Ha, oh, that was awesome! That was so great! Oh, I can't wait. Uh, now I'm now I'm just like, no, I'm just bloodthirsty. I just want to destroy the Crystal City. Um, I got the taste of blood and I saw some of those capital ships. I'm like, oh, that looks like fun to beat up. <laughs> we still haven't got the Exeter ship. Oh, I just want to keep playing this game. I wish I had more time, guys. I, I just wish I had more time to play more stuff. All right, let's uh, let's see what we can sell here. We're at, we are officially out of time, but that's okay. I'm gonna see if I can sell more stuff, sell stuff here, and see if we can get a good price because they are a small city. Oh well, good price for titanium. Well, we'll sell everything we have of that, and good price. That's it. Just good price for titanium. Ah, oh, it's too bad. Well, we're gonna sell everything we have except for we're not gonna sell our palladium. We're not gonna sell our osmium. We're gonna sell that. Okay, so that's that's good. We made a little bit of money there. We will undock. I wonder. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold uh, on. Yes, and we are gonna go kill that pirate station or the pirate base. I know exactly where they are too. Those sons of a. Oh, we can actually repair here. Awesome. Oh, fantastic. Uh, was there anything here that we could buy that's worth buying? No, 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 no. no. Now it would be cool to see what we can buy and sell stuff at our own station or at our own city. While we're out on the run, you know? That would be kind of cool. Uh, we are going to go kill that pirate base right now. We are fully re fully repaired. We have uh, three extra ships. Uh, uh, Chimera, two Chimera 3s and one Chimera 2. We did lose one, I think, somewhere. Yeah. Yeah, that's exactly what's happening. I, I'm going right to the source. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna go fight them, you know, at our station or anything, like at our radar station. That's silly. I am going to destroy them at the source, <laughs> and claim the area so that they can't. Uh, they can't put another pirate base there. That is the way to do this. We should have enough money. Oh, there's so much going on here. So, uh, reputation with Valdor has increased, right? Because we traded with them. That's really good. Um, uh, Skiggerin. Skig Skiggerun declared war on Mars Ara. Oh, yeah. Big big fight going on there for sure. Uh, Crydon. Well, yeah, they're they're negative with us now because we attacked attacked their enemy, which was New Brazil, but then we also uh, came to their aid lots of time and lots of border tension, and I think they are now friends with Crystal City, which is that's that's just wonderful. Like, how great is that? Um, because Crystal City hates hates us, like despises us. And they're a perfect ally for Crystal City because they have no borders. They don't share any borders. That's awesome for them. Good for you guys. All right, we're gonna destroy this base. I know it's here. If it's not, it's here. Or it could be here, but it's most likely here. There it is, ha ha ha. Ah, you sons of you know what's. Oh, there's nobody here. Well, all right, well, let's just kill their base then. <laughs> Oh, that's great. Uh, they're they're off attacking my station. Uh, that's why. Oh, I actually really like that. So their main fleet's off attacking our station. So it just allows us to kill their base. How fantastic is that? And that means we can also... Uh, we forgot to go back and get all the goodies from that other base. Oh, man. There's just so many goodies lying around. That's a thing. Oh, too late, guys. Um, I've already killed your base. <laughs> all right. Full speed ahead. Oh, and, ah, oh, it's like that Battlestar Galactica thing. So, as soon as you kill their pirate base, um, they have no power, I guess. It, I don't know, it's like we hack their system when you do that. That's awesome. Oh, there's gonna be a lot of goodies here. A lot of goodies. Yeah, we're just crushing them. Crush! 
<laughs> Honestly, I'm just key mashing. <laughs> if you're wondering how I'm doing the combat now, like, really, there's not a lot of thought going into it because, I don't know, it's pretty chaotic. <laughs> not enough energy. Oh, not to shoot, I guess. Oh, there's still one more bad guy. All right, well, let's kill this guy. Done and done and done. All right. Uh, I still think as we upgrade our ship, we should have access to more drones. Because, I don't know, it just seems like the right thing to do. Seems like the right thing to do because... Uh, and I also want to be able to customize my ship somehow or just have a really big ship. You know, like, as I upgrade my ship, it needs to change. It needs to look different. And I know it's coming. I know it's coming. I'm so demanding. I'm a gamer. <laughs> yeah, someday I'm going to have an interview with these guys and uh, I'm going to be civilized, I promise. Because... Honestly, I love the game so far, and I guess that's why I'm so excited about, you know, what p could potentially happen with this game is because it is that good already. It's really good. Um, of course, uh, I am totally out of time. <laughs> I'm chatting away, just blah, 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 and, uh, you know, gotta go to work, gotta go to work. Um, uh, is that the most? Oh, I'm out, out of range. What do you mean I'm out of range? No, I'm, I'm full. Says I'm out of range of the station. How can I be out of the range of the station? Hold on. Oh, that's a bug. I found a bug, guys. I found a bug. That's always fun. Yeah, it says I'm out of range of the station. I am not out of range. I'm hitting the S button and the drones aren't working. Can I manually send them off? Mining drone. Nope. All right, so I found a bug. Awesome. You're welcome. You're welcome, Praxy Entertainment. All right, we're going to go, and i got to call this an episode. I hope you enjoyed this one. Super awesome, fun battles. And look at all the pirates scattered to the wind.